Yes, we're back. We're back again in ETS 2. We're back again carrying on our roaming driver series where the aim was to get from as far away from London in pro mods as we could back to London only via quick jobs. And last time we made it to Dijon in France. This time, can we get closer to London? Can we do it? It won't be in that truck there because that's the last one I drove in a live stream. More about that during the trip. But let's see what we can do. Grab that guidebook to trucking in France in ETS 2, and let's go. So hi there, Steve here, and yes, welcome back to ETS 2. If you're new to my content, welcome indeed. Uh, this currently going out on Trucking Saturday. Uh, other content for me, though, is OMSI on a Monday, Trains on a Wednesday, on a Friday, rotating between Firm Bus, Taurus Bus, and The Bus, and occasionally on a Sunday, something random. Uh, so yes, the aim was, all those many weeks ago, uh, not in Glasgow, that's where we ended up in a live stream, uh, was to get from as far away from London as we could. So I started down here and then get back to London uh, only via quick jobs. And last time we finally entered France and we made it to Dijon. Where can we end up this time? Can we finally be heading towards London? I have not looked. I've got no idea. Uh, so let's do that. The jobs should already still be sorted uh, via um, the longest, uh, sorry, shortest length first. So we can find Dijon, there it is. Uh, Their heavy haulage things can't do those. Uh, Dijon to Bourges. That could be interesting. Salzburg's going the wrong way. Felix though, going the right way, but a bit long. I think it's going to be Bourges then. Let's, uh, let's take that. That was too easy. Oh, it's daylight as well. Drive safe. Okay, what are we in? We're in an MAN. No, we're not. We're in a DAF. With uh, some things. Let's pull this out. Interesting colour. Let's take a uh, cheeky screenshot. Like that. Right, get back inside then. 385 miles because we are on small roads. Let's get straight on it. That way. Turn right. I'm turning right. Turning right. Ready to turn left. I'm, I'm getting ready to, to turn, turn left. left. I'm turning left. It's, it's a thing. It's happening. Look. Right then. Let's make our merry way. So yes, really enjoying uh, doing this uh, doing this series uh, and these journeys. And um, as I've said in previous videos, although if you might be new to this, uh, it's currently going out on a Saturday. Uh, it's moved from a Sunday. Uh, Saturday uh, is somewhere I'm going to keep some trucking content. So uh, we'll finish this journey and uh, get our way to London. And then uh, I'm going to be starting again, doing the same thing, the same idea. Um, but in uh, American truck sim. So going to be going from as far away from Los Angeles uh, as I can. Go straight. And uh, make our way to Los Angeles only via quick jobs. So uh, that's going to be uh, interesting. Okay, we can get out halfway here. Okay, they're turning off. The other truck go what's oh, there waiting for me that's fine right we'll follow the coca-cola one uh so yes uh gonna be uh, starting again in uh in america doing the same sort of thing um and then i might actually start again again uh, i really do enjoy uh just starting out from the very beginning in this and uh, again doing some quick jobs but starting out on a brand new profile um just showing you what it's like to uh to get the game and start from the very beginning so uh, that may continue uh, and then also start looking at some uh, some mods so some mod trucks some mods for the uh, for the game and uh, seeing what enhancements uh, they bring so uh, trucking continuing on a Saturday 
and uh, say other content from me then you know omsi on a monday Go straight staying where it is uh, trains on a wednesday staying where they are and on a friday rotating between firm bus tourist bus and the bus on a three weekly rotation and you know some random stuff some new stuff on a sunday and maybe some uh, some single player or multiplayer stuff chucked out there on a tuesday and thursday as well so at least four videos a week uh, from me on youtube but uh, could be more so uh, in 1.40 now in uh, ETS2 which is looking really nice and running Pro Mods 2.55 and they seem to be uh, working together quite nicely and uh, didn't see what flavour of DAF this is we'll have a look when we stop doesn't feel as though it's very powerful we've got 15 tons of load but in the same way as it was when we got to um, Lyon via Italy uh, I do leave it set on small roads so it's not taking us the quickest way or most direct way to our destination it's taking us uh, Go straight. the small roads way which actually makes it more interesting more entertaining well I say entertaining not from my point of view obviously but you know interesting was probably the word different yeah I think interesting was probably the wrong word there but more, more different is that why you keep breaking and they've got the uh, the coca-colas on board But you know, I would would really like to get to uh, to Borge. Be quite handy, really. This truck actually sounds quite nice. Not sure about the colour. Get ready to turn right. I am getting ready to do the right turning. It's coming up here, in fact. Turn right. Always oh, turning right. <laughs> that's always one of those things that you happen in real life, isn't it? You're, you're following behind someone that's really slow, and you're going, "Oh, I've got to turn off up here." I hope they don't turn off, and they do. It's like, "Oh, really?" There's a journey I used to make uh, regularly um, for uh, quite a few years between uh, where I live and uh, Birmingham. And uh, there was one point through the Cotswolds where if I was following someone really slowly, that if they turned one way, I would go the other way. Which added sort of 10 miles onto my journey. But it's just sometimes it's just nice to not have the pain. So yeah, you know, I may arrive later, but I'm not going to be annoyed being stuck behind someone slow whilst doing so. Are we going to follow this Coca-Cola lorry all the way? I don't mind it but you know I'd rather not if given the you know, choice could go for the overtake I'll see if we end up on any dual carriageway or anything for now we'll follow the coca-colas uh, if you are new to this content, by the way, there is some links down in the description below. Um, one to the Twitch page, uh, where you can watch me live on Twitch six days of the week. Um, where we do some uh, multiplayer trucking. Um, so the truck you saw in the uh, opening thing uh, was the one I used in the last live stream. So... Uh, Get ready to turn. That's right. something we do and have been doing for a number of years. And uh, also a link down there 
is the uh, Discord server as well. An awesome community on Discord. And of course, he's turning right. Because, you know, why wouldn't he? We are just going to follow him, aren't we, for the next 299 miles. I was really hoping to get a section where we could actually get some speed up. But maybe not. Go for it. Holy moly! Okay, yeah, that was uh, that was interesting. <laughs> that car coming towards me would have been in a bit of a state of panic. It'd have been, oh, there's a vehicle truck coming towards me. It's fine. We, we got round. I can now finally make a bit of progress. Hang on. Are we switching? What? Um, okay. <laughs> Is that a border? <laughs> Please don't say that's a border. I'm, I'm sure I just saw... No. It wasn't, was it? Oh, to my left, up here. What sort of route is this thing taking me on? I'm scared to look at the map. We've got two... Yeah, thankfully we're not turning, <laughs> turning left and crossing the border. Where is that way? Yeah, Geneva. It is. That's the, the Swiss border. <laughs> it's just down there. Where is it taking me? What are you doing to me, game? We're going back towards Lyon. We came from Lyon. Why? <laughs> what? What? We're going to see the scenery, which is, you know, it's something, I suppose. And, you know, 1.40 looking stunning. But wasn't it, wasn't expecting to be close to the Swiss border when going from Dijon to Bourges, which is going west. So I'm really confused as to where we are now. We're still in France. Well, but no, we are, because we haven't crossed. But we're still in France. How? What? Where are we going to go when we end up in London? If we ever end up in London. This is taking us west. So, in theory, we could head now towards um, the port at Roscoff. And then come into London via... Or come into the UK via Plymouth or something. That would be... Uh, at least that would be something. Okay, we're now stuck behind a coach doing 30. Get ready to turn left. Right, Leon is that way. Turn left. We're going left. I wonder if there's enough fuel in this thing. I think there is. We should be fine. It'll be fine. No, honestly. No, it will. What on earth is this thing down? What's going on down here now? A combine? Oh, is it, what is that? It's a combine. Without the header. Farming, by the way, uh, one of the games that we uh, we stream uh, at least once a week on uh, on Twitch. 
and something that I uh, I really enjoy. Look how awesome this looks, though. Apart from obviously being stuck behind the combine. I shouldn't really be overtaking on these sorts of roads. Because I can't see. So it'd be dangerous to overtake. There is a straight coming up. Up here though, so we'll give that a go. Okay, around this corner. Oh, that's uh, slowing down. And we've got a light. Oh, turning right. Woohoo! That's quite cool, actually. Weird looking combine, but it's quite cool. Car four down there. Wow, that'd be an interesting place to load from. Blimey. Not getting big in there. At the roundabout, take the second exit. I am taking the second exit. I've exited. It's a thing, it happened. Right, let's get my foot down again. See what other country you're going to end up in now. Just as we start getting a move on roundabout. At the roundabout, take the second exit. I'm taking the second exit again. Leon and Dijon are that exit way. Now. Both places we've been. I'm really scared to look at the map because we've now got the same distance that we had when we left uh, Dijon to get to Bourges to go to Bourges. So it's added on like 130 miles to our trip. Should be good now. Right. Pedal to the metal. We don't want any uh, any more roundabouts. Any more roads that are too twisty. Apart from the one that's coming up down here that looks quite twisty. To slow us down. We're due to arrive at 20 past 7. But this is the thing that I really enjoy about having small roads on. Is that you're not just sat on the motorway. You do get these... Uh, these twisty roads that make the journey uh, less boring and I really enjoyed doing this um, quick jobs thing because you don't know what truck you're going to end up with you don't know what load you end up with you don't know where you're going to go um, it certainly makes for an interesting experience I say it'd be great to hear from you if uh, oh god that's just getting twisty uh, if you've done something like this have you tried doing the same thing I'm doing have you uh, started somewhere with an aim of getting somewhere else and just taken quick jobs uh, certainly adds uh, a reason to do some trucking so you're not just going I'll go here I'll go here you know it tells you where you're going you don't decide uh, that's quite cool I really must try one of these again with a manual gearbox. It's been a long time since I've actually used a manual in uh, in ETS2. But because all trucks are auto now, there's no real need to use manual. Right, 
Right, slowing. More slowing. Wow, this is twisty. But quite cool. We've still got 174 miles to go. Oh, matron. See, is it just what still makes after all these years? Uh, makes this just really enjoyable. Why have we got a... Oh, I'm guessing there's Robux. Oh, we got no horn. What flavour are we? It's a 460. Okay. So, no wonder it uh, didn't feel overly quick. Well, 15 tonnes on it, though. I mean, it could have coped with a bit more weight. So, now we're stuck behind another truck. That's come from Switzerland. I am getting ready to turn left, which is exactly where this truck's going to go. Yeah, there we are. Turn left. I am turning left. Right, a wide swing of that. Right, 164 miles to go. I only thought it was a couple of hundred miles when I picked it, thinking, oh yeah, perfect. But yeah, and forgetting the uh, adding in for the small roads adds miles, and then didn't anticipate them being twisty. But, you know, we're, we're getting there. It's heading towards the UK-ish. Heading west, but, you know, it's, we're, we're getting, it's, well, it's, you know, sort of heading roughly, maybe slightly in the right direction sort of ish possibly well it's not really is it more twistiness that's more twi that's more more of it coming up more of the more of the twisty that's that no, we just no you just go really really slowly around here that's fine even incredibly slowly that's you know it works for me Okay, no, 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 it's absolutely fine. No, you just, uh, you just toodle along at, uh, at 30, which is the speed limit. I, I can't complain. That is the, the limit of the speed. Not really helpful when, you know, I'm still 150 miles away from my destination, but no, it's okay. Oh, there's braking. That's my wheel shaking. Obese. Well, a couple of extra pounds, but not quite. Go straight. We're no longer obese. Well, I lost that weight quickly. Okay, so I'm turning left at this roundabout. I can almost guarantee where this truck will be going. Because, you know, it's just been one of those journeys, hasn't it? Slow trucks, combines. What is... they're not indicating. At the roundabout, take the third exit. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Hey, going down there. Exit now. I'm exiting. Right. Let's do this. We've got rid of the truck. Pedal to the metal. Slowly. 
it's what a customer expects delivery very soon. Make sure you arrive on time. Well, I got stuck behind a combine harvester in a truck. I'm still 130 miles away. I'm not expecting delivery really soon. Like in the next 10 minutes. It'll be there in the next three hours. Hopefully. Right, 12th gear. 50 miles an hour. Let's get these miles down. Nice river. Ah! Nice sign. At the roundabout, take the first exit. Interesting roundabout. Exit. Now. Oh, okay, might have slightly clipped the curve of the roundabout. It's fine. Right, I got rid of some miles. 111 to go. So next time we'll carry on from Borge, hopefully we'll head, okay, we'll head north. Uh, that'd be really handy to head towards the port. So something around the 200 miles is what I'm aiming for. I was hoping now to get this finished in like 20 episodes, uh, but I don't think that's going to be the case. I forgot what number this is. 17? 18? 17 or 18? 18. 19? 18. 18 or 19. It's, it's a number. So we might get there in the same amount of episodes as my age. So uh, uh, 21. Audi.com. You're enjoying that apple, aren't you? But well, you hate apples, really, but you're an actor. And uh, you've been paid to uh, make it look like you're eating an apple. But yeah, just smile and put the apple there. That's fine. Oh, we've got our first toll coming up. I actually managed to cut through uh, a bit of France and nearly Switzerland uh, without actually going to a toll. So we've got to get on that road down there, yeah. Breaking lots of it. We'll go in this one then because that truck's gone in that one. Right, 82 miles to go. Let's get on that uh, motorway and see if we can uh, bang out some of those 80 miles. Paris is that way, Lyon's that way. But don't go to Lyon, that's where we came from. Break, 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 break. Okay, Mr. Audi, you just it's just been just what following one thing and then another, isn't it? Not that it's that truck driver's fault, but okay, let's just go out here. Right, go go. Take these. Back in there. Right, 68 miles to go. We can do this.
70 miles an hour, slightly exceeding what the truck should be doing. Not my truck, not my fuel. Even at these sort of speeds, it sounds quite cool. I've got the turbo noise uh, tweaked and increased. I do like to hear a good turbo. Wow, we're actually picking up a decent amount of speed now. I was saying earlier about I quite like being on small roads because uh, you do get the twisty stuff which is great but sometimes just a short burst on the motorway like this that's cool too <laughs> 86 miles an hour another two more and we go back to the future 87 88 miles an hour. You built a time machine right. out of a DAF. Right. 90, blimey. Okay, lots of braking. Exit right. I'm exiting right. I'm doing the right exiting. Ooh. Forty-four pound toll, blimey. Cut up that car leaving the toll. At the roundabout, take the first exit. I'm gonna take the first exit without crashing into the car. And there we are, we are making it to Bourges. Get ready to turn right. Turn right. I'm turning right. And continue straight. Okay. Go straight. Okay, I'm doing it. Through the gates we go. This is where it ends. Wow. It's a bit terminal, isn't it? And there we are, arriving in Bourges. In a rather cool little laugh. Quite like that. Uh, what an enjoyable journey. So yes, next time we will leave uh, Borsch. That's why I was expecting to go there. Look, it took us all the way around there to get up here to Borsch. Uh, next time we'll leave Borsch and hopefully uh, either head towards Southampton or maybe even across here to Roscoff and then up into London. Uh, we are getting there. Maybe one, two more to go. And... Uh, we will finally reach our destination. Um, so yes, don't forget to check out those links in the description uh, below where uh, you can check out the Twitch page and the Discord server. Um, and uh, don't forget to subscribe to see more trucking from me on a late, uh, on, a, uh, on a Saturday, as well as all that other content as well. We will end there. Next time we will carry on from here. Until then, if you have been... Thanks very, very much for watching.